Hello everyone. Welcome to PB Maths. In this video, we are going to find the value of 3 root 2 divided by root 3 plus root 6 minus 4 root 3 divided by root 6 plus root 2 plus root 6 divided by root 3 plus root 2. If you are interested to solve this problem, you can pause this video now and solve the question. Let's get into the solution. 3 root 2 could be written as root 3 times root 3 times root 2 divided by root 3 plus that root 6 could be written as root 3 into root 2 minus in the second term 4 root 3 could be written as root 2 into root 2 into 2 root 3 divided by root 6 could be written as root 2 into root 3 plus root 2 and let's write that third term that is root 6 divided by root 3 plus root 2 as it is then in the first term denominator part we can factor out root 3 then we have root 3 into root 3 into root 2 divided by root 3 times 1 plus root 2 minus in the second term let's write that numerator part as it is root 2 times root 2 times 2 root 3 divided by here we can factor out root 2 so root 2 times root 3 plus 1 then let's rewrite that third term as it is now in the first term both in the numerator and denominator we can cancel root 3 then minus in the second term root 2 got cancelled plus that third term root 6 divided by root 3 plus root 2 as it is then now we have root 6 divided by 1 plus root 2 minus 2 root 3 into root 2 which is equals to 2 root 6 divided by root 3 plus 1 plus root 6 divided by root 3 plus root 2. Now in these three terms we have root 6 in common. Let's factor out that root 6. Then we have root 6 times 1 by 1 plus root 2 minus 2 by root 3 plus 1 plus 1 by root 3 plus root 2. Then let's rationalize the denominators of each terms and simplify. Then we have root 6 is equals 1 divided by 1 plus root 2 into root 2 minus 1 divided by root 2 minus 1 minus 2 by root 3 plus 1 into root 3 minus 1 divided by root 3 minus 1 plus 1 divided by root 3 plus root 2 into root 3 minus root 2 divided by root 3 minus root 2. Then we have root 6 is equals root 2 minus 1 divided by root 2 whole square minus 1 that is in the form of a plus b into bracket a minus b which is equals to a square minus p square then in the second term we have 2 root 3 minus 2 divided by root 3 whole square minus 1 plus in the third term we have root 3 minus root 2 divided by root 3 whole square minus root 2 whole square then in the next step we have root 6 into root 2 minus 1 divided by 2 minus 1 minus 2 times of root 3 minus 1 divided by 3 minus 1 which is equals to 2 plus at last we have root 3 minus root 2 divided by 3 minus 2 then root 6 into root 2 minus 1 minus 
here in the second term in the numerator we are factoring that 2 so 2 and 2 get cancelled root 3 minus 1 remains plus in the third term we have root 3 minus root 2 divided by 1 then in the next step we have root 6 into root 2 minus 1 minus in bracket root 3 minus 1 plus root 3 minus root 2 let's multiply that minus in that second term then we have root 6 times we have root 2 minus 1 minus root 3 plus 1 then plus root 3 minus 2 each get cancelled here at last we have 0 so root 6 into 0 is equals 0 therefore the value of 3 root 2 divided by root 3 plus root 6 minus 4 root 3 divided by root 6 plus root 2 plus root 6 divided by root 3 plus root 2 is equals to 0. I hope you got this solution. Thank you for watching the video.